Hi guys, hope you're well. I just wanted to jump on here and talk about the importance of influence. Every day we're either influencing or being influenced. It's one of the many transactions we're having with life. In business, we use influence to accomplish two things, either to get people to buy our products or services or influence ourselves or our teams to improve our or their effectiveness. Essentially, our effectiveness is directly proportional to our ability to influence the people around us. One of the most successful ways to create influence is by being influential. Influence your electorate into voting for you to become the next president, if that's what you choose, and the influence you'd then hold as a result of winning would be even greater. As an example, if I was to introduce you to my friends as an incredible human being, with a great circle of friends yourself, warm, hospitable and generous, with a great sense of humour, then I'd become influential in painting a picture to everyone else about your personality. In doing so, I would increase my own influence even further. This activates the reciprocity principle of persuasion that we'll cover in another video. In this, we're indebted to pay that gift of a compliment back to us at a later date. The reciprocation of this may not come in the form of another compliment, but something larger and more beneficial to our own success. In today's society of social media, there's never been a greater opportunity to reach more people than ever before. With the emphasis on that social element of social media, people can equally build groups, communities, followers and tribes who can spread their messages to others. That gives them the potential to influence more people than ever before. No longer does influence come from titles or hierarchies within organisations. Nowadays, influence is now created by credibility, as it always has done, but even more so. Refining your message and then sharing it passionately in innovative and creative ways. Doing this creates virality, where an idea, concept or message spreads like wildfire and reaches a maximum audience. People become followers or fans, and this reiterates the idea that you can simply create influence by being influential. Much like the law of inertia, influence is an action that starts and then maintains motion until something pushes or pulls on it. Therefore, people with strong persuasive abilities can influence those people who are open to being influenced, thus starting the motion, and then propel them forward once they're engaged, thus maintaining that motion. Influence also allows you to build a community. You could nurture existing connections and build new relationships. Equally so, you can grow your community and ensure that they're both loyal and strong brand ambassadors for your brand. By doing this, your loyal community will reciprocate with the leadership you've shown them and support you through difficult times to ensure a higher chance that your brand company will weather any metaphorical storms that would otherwise destroy other companies or businesses with a less loyal fan base. With a loyal community, you can also celebrate victories and equally you can support each other in their losses. When you ask most people what they want out of life, one of the most common replies after it's all distilled down is I want to be happy. Happiness is one of the few things in life which increases when it's shared. Thus, it's far more satisfying to reach your goal or outcome with a group than by yourself. Having the ability to persuade and influence people effectively, either online or offline, will ensure that both you and your community will be more effective and achieve a greater level of success too. I hope to see you in the next video. Talk to you soon. Bye.